Hey guys, welcome back. Quick slurp. Beautiful. Right, over here we'll just show you. We've got some um, DFC, some dump fried chicken. It's my um, secret recipe. It's got flour. Basically I dunked, I cut the whole chicken up into pieces, the whole entire chicken. Then I um, put it in egg, eggs with a bit of milk. And then I dunked it into my favorite sauce, um, flour and various herbs in there. I'm not gonna tell you everything. Right, over here. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna try and make a nice Mexican salad. All right, so here we go. So just, yep. Yeah. What we're gonna do is we're gonna cut the salad up into nice kind of bite-sized pieces. So we'll cut that into four. And just move back a tiny bit now, sorry. sorry. We'll just cut it up. All right, and then we're gonna go about that size. Whoa, lovely bit of lettuce, right into the bowl. Just open all that up. Nice. Of the yellow heart in the middle, that's the best part, or yellow or light green, if you will. Beautiful. Wunderbar. Magnifique. All right. Whatever. Right, now, um, the usual Mexicans would use um, normal tomatoes. They would, um, you know, take the water out, dice them up. But I figured I'm just going to use these little ones because the tomatoes over here in England, especially here at the moment, are bloody tasteless. So these little cherry tomatoes are much better. I'm just going to chop these bad boys up. Pieces. Stay with me, might as well do all of them. Ching chong. Ching chong. Ching chong. Ching chong. Two. Oh. Two. A few more. Sorry, I won't bore you. Should have maybe have done that before, but anyway, doesn't matter. What's the most amazing part of this thing is gonna be like the old vinaigrette. You'll see later. All right, in goes the tomatoes into the bowl. Beautiful. Now, I didn't have any um, tin corn, so I've got to use real corn. I boiled it, and we're just going to chuck that in there too. So just down like this. So you do it, guys, if you're just wondering. Beautiful. Pick this up and break it with ye old fingers. It's going to be good. Right, stay there. Again. Okay, what we got next? Then we have some nice kidney beans to make it sort of like Mexican. It's going to be good. Then. Avocado. Now this is what kind of makes it expensive over here. I don't know about you guys or wherever you are in the world, but it's well expensive over here, man. Anyway, so good. If you want to know how to do that, just in with a spoon, scrape it around. Look at that. One piece. Beautiful. Whoops. I'm going to stay there. Next one. Another piece all the way around. Bosch. Okay, then we're going to just chop that up into pieces. Come to the top, sit about. I'll mix it about later with my hands, anyhow. Is that everything for the salad? That's everything for the salad. I'm just gonna wash my hands. Whoops! Bloody hell, I totally forgot. Right over here, should put the bloody chicken in. Fuck. Sorry, no sorry. All right, in goes the chicken. Should have done this about well, when I started doing the bleeding salad, really. What an idiot. Oh well. There it goes.
And you know, like with the chicken, I cut like so the legs, legs in half, the wings with part of the breast. And then also use the under part of it, which are just the bones, but trust me, there's still loads of meat on there. It's probably the best part, to be honest. I don't know, is this all gonna fit? Hopefully, probably a bit much in there. Oh dear, let's do it anyway. Just because I can't be bothered to do two dips. All right, in it goes. We'll just leave that in there. Right, then we'll come back over here. I'm going to make the uh, beautiful sauce. Yes, yeah, so we'll just leave that in there. Okay, sauce. So I'm going to use this one to mix it up. I'm going to cheat. I use like the, uh, the lazy garlic and I don't care. It's amazing. Two big spoonfuls of that. Bosh, in there. Right, then we're gonna put, um, originally it's um, oregano, I didn't have any. I forgot to buy it. So I'm gonna put some dry uh, thyme. Then that, that, that. Ah, very important, this one. Cumin. Nice little spoonful of cumin in there. Bosh, that, and believe it or not, Bit of this one, kids are not going to be happy. One, well, she ain't, but Frank Nathan is, he loves it. Right now, lime, just roll it around, get as much juice as we can out of it, and then we're just going to squeeze that in there. Can't really see, but let's try and have a look. Should have a machine, really, but. I haven't got one. Oh. oh yeah, it's gonna be good. Keep squeezing, and then I'll do another one actually. Two, two lime juices in there. Go there, Nathan. One more. In goes the, oh yeah. Nice and juicy, that one. Whoa. One, in fact, now I think that's enough. Then we're going to stay there. We're going to add some nice salt. Himalayan pink salt. And then some pepper. Just stay there, I'm coming back. Pepper. And then of course the final bit, olive oil put quite a bit in there and then basically if there's some left I can use it another time I okay, think that's good well let's just have a quick look at the meat then or the poultry should I say is it ready yet Turn. yes look at that oh my goodness Be careful cameraman it's very hot oil Looking good. So that'll probably take 10 15 minutes. Anyway, back over here, I shall put the lid. Oh my goodness! I really forgot the most important part. What an idiot. Coriander. Lots of it. God, I can't believe I even forgot that. So I'm just going to chop that up. in there and she goes all right lid on top this is the easiest oh wrong lid where's my lid gone man oh there it is and this is the easiest way to mix a vinaigrette up with french people will tell you that Look at that. 
put my finger in there and try it. Mm. Wow, really tastes the cumin, right? Oh my God. Shit hot I am. And there you have it. So, quick zoom in there, quick picture Nathan. Beautiful Mexican salad with some DFC. Dominic fried chicken. I'd, I'd bore you guys for, it's probably gonna take another five minutes. There's no point in staying here. But you can imagine how good this is gonna be. You can see it already. Beautiful. So there you have it for my beautiful Mexican salad and my Dominic fried chicken. Quick slurp. Over and out.